Hey everyone, welcome to the Crypto ZX channel. Hope you're all having a wonderful, wonderful Saturday or Sunday wherever you are around the world. I really appreciate you guys stopping by the channel today. Today, as you guys can tell, we are going to be talking about Quant QNT token. What are some next price targets we should be looking at? What is the future? And where could the price be going as we approach the new month of February coming up for us? Um, but before I begin, just a quick disclaimer for everyone that anything on this channel is not financial advice always do your own due diligence and research when you are investing in cryptocurrencies looking at the price of quant it is currently trading at hundred and forty eight dollars and fifty cents down about three percent in the last 24 hours in usd comparative also down about 2.3 percent in bitcoin comparative over the last 24 hours remember the entire market right now is seeing a little bit of a retracement which is a healthy correction which we do need and um, obviously we are in a weekend and weekends tend to have lab a have a lot of manipulation across the board so uh, you know that is something that we do need to keep in mind obviously because the CME futures are closed during the weekends but if we're looking at the price of um, you know Quant currently trading at $148 holding very very strongly market cap currently sitting at 2.1 billion dollars and the 24 hour trading volume currently sitting at 22.6 million dollars one thing that i can point out for us that might not be as positive is that the overall buying pressure for q and t is just not there right now which is not a big concern obviously that can change organically but that is something that i do want to point out for you guys but if we're looking at the bigger picture guys in just the last year alone we are up about 60.4 percent and i do believe q and t is headed to all time highs this year yes you heard that right but now let's get right into the price and see what's happening and where it could we be going in the immediate short term so this is what i wanted to share with you guys we're finding ourselves a little bit of a uh, you know, hard time breaking out uh, towards the upset, and the reason as to why is because you know this level of resistance over here at the $155 mark that has been playing as a massive level of resistance for us. And you know, this goes all the way back to even um, or last year. You guys can see we try to break out of here. Oopsies, not this. We need this. You guys can see we try to break out of here once rejection, another time rejection. Uh, we even got a rejection around here but finally shot up but obviously after uh, unfortunate news came out uh, in November after the FTX collapse and that obviously impacted the price of QNT token but once again we're finding ourselves back at that level of resistance and this should show us the importance of this level of resistance and how massive it really is. But guys, I am expecting that QNT has what it takes to break out towards the upside over here. And once we break out, guys, then, you know, things can start looking very, very nice because then we'll be back, uh, you know, to this level in no time, which is the 61.8. And the craziest part is during a bear market, we saw one project, which is QNT, almost hit 0.50 Fibonacci retracement level. That is very rare to see. But you do see every bull a bear mar market, you know, you see one or two or a few like handful projects that do outperform the entire market and QNT was one of them. And I do believe this year, this year specifically and not too far away, we are going to see QNT smash all time highs very unique projects and if you are following qnt very closely they are making massive massive announcements left and right and obviously the price action is not coming as a surprise to anyone at this point uh, but yeah like i said right now all eyes are on this level of resistance if you are a qnt holder and you really want to be looking at qnt uh, to kind of get a confirmation that we are breaking out you know all eyes should be on this specific level at that 155 dollar mark if we break out of there things are about to heat up and i do expect that's very very close obviously as i say that we always need to keep an eye on bitcoin Obviously, last year when QNT was making a move, uh, QNT did not really care about uh, Bitcoin. Bitcoin was at its highest volatility at that point, and QNT was outperforming the entire market. If you guys were following my channel, but right now 
obviously Bitcoin needs to be looked at. It's the king of the markets. Everything is correlated at the end of the day with BTC, but BTC has been holding very, very strongly at that 23K mark, and I'm extremely bullish as long as we're above $22,000 mark. But like I said, you know, QNT is about to shock a lot of people, and I do believe this is going to be one of the very few projects that's going to hit all-time highs very soon, along with a handful of others, and I believe Polygon Matic is going to be another one that's going to hit all-time highs quite soon uh, compared to the entire market but that is it for today's update you know QNT holders you guys have been showing so much support on my video so I love each and every one of you guys continue doing so and I'll continue delivering these videos for you guys every other day and that's a promise from me thank you so much and come join me on my Twitter I forgot to mention a link in the description box below see you guys tomorrow I've been crypto ZX and peace out